You want to go to land in the first time in a week? You want to go for a walk? Oh my goodness. What? A walk on land? Oh my goodness. Oh. Today is a happy, happy day. We're Today we are done with the Atlantic. <laughs> Officially. Uh, it really <laughs> set in this morning for Jen. Yeah, it, I my chest is no longer tight. Um, I feel like I can breathe again. It's amazing. <laughs> it may be a gloomy day outside, but do not... Inside pivot, it's sunshine. Oh, it is sunshine, smiles. rainbows, <laughs> unicorns. It is all smiles. I'm so happy to be done. <laughs> As you guys know from our last vlog, we had a 12-hour cruise from Atlantic City to here, which is Sandy Hook, in the lower bay just outside of New York. And we had some fuel issues, so the plan was to get fuel this morning. We actually have a good amount of fuel. We have 90 gallons right now. Um, but we were going to get fuel, and it's raining. So we so figured... We don't want to get water into our fuel tanks because that just sounds like a problem waiting to happen. It's just, yeah, it, it could have... Could we do it in a way that we don't get water in? Maybe. It's not worth the risk. So yeah. we're just gonna go to Staten Island. That's where we have our marina slip for the next few days to see some family. Yeah. And get fuel afterwards later, our next cruise. Yeah, before we like really start cruising. Yeah. So join us today. We're Jen, Elliot, and Ollie. In 2019, we booked a one-way flight to Colombia, and after traveling to 11 countries, we were locked down in India for five months. Coming back to the US, we decided to pivot into boat life and cruise on a 6,000 mile journey called America's Great Loop. Make sure to subscribe as we share the highs, lows, and everything in between. Very nice thing to having a trawler with an inside helm station is cruising days like today. All right, ready? Yep, let's do it. Let's raise the anchor. Okay. Are you out of your seat up here? You look kind of miserable. Wet dog. You could have been inside. Good visibility.
We made it to our ninth United state. state of New York. Woo! Welcome Woo! to New York. <laughs> We're so happy to be here. We have Jennifer who was actually born on Long Island and has a lot of family here. Yeah, a so lot of stories that we'll tell over the next few vlogs. So we're going to see a lot of family in the next few days and we're not really sure what we're going to actually do in the city. We may not even go into the city. Who knows? Um, yeah, but we are so happy to be here and so excited to see family. <sighs> and Woo! so excited to be out of the Atlantic. Ninth state. That's crazy. Woo! This Making will be our progress. last state before Canada. Yeah. Wow. Wow. How was docking? Docking was great. We had three dock hands. Um, three people helped us with our line, so that was excellent. And the people here are very friendly. We are so excited to be here because it's actually affordable for New York standards. $2 a foot. $2 a foot. It is, I think, specific though for loopers. It's not for just all transient boaters. But we are just so happy to be here. I mean, just like, yeah, I mean, we're gonna be seeing family. Ollie's gonna go to land. We're gonna go to land. <laughs> it's just, yeah, so happy. <laughs> oh. You gonna go for a walk? What? Let's do it. <laughs> You are such a good girl. You did your business on the boat. Multiple, multiple times. Let's go for a walk. Let's go. <laughs> Was that not long enough of a walk? Jeez. That was like seven hours. It's the next day. As part of our celebration that we are out of the Atlantic and that we made it safely to Staten Island, I cooked up a kind of a feast for breakfast. Some potatoes, some vegetarian sausages, and some eggs. So, ah. It's like a breath of fresh air having that big uh, big travel day behind us. The forecast shifted a little bit and it's sunny. So we are gonna clean the outside of the boat. We are in the process of prepping pivot for guests. Nobody's staying over, but Jennifer's brother and sister-in-law will be seeing the boat for the first time. They live up in New Jersey, um, about an hour from here. And then tomorrow, Jennifer's sister and nephew will be coming on board for the first time. And we just want to give them a nice clean pivot, not a pivot that we haven't left for seven days. <laughs> 
to start off, I changed the fuel filter. That was uh, first priority. It's been 200 hours, um, and we kind of had a slow start today. So that's kind of our signal um, before we need to change it. And yeah, and I'm glad the sun came out so we can actually clean pivot and give her a good showing. The only thing that we haven't been able to get off is the ICW mustache. Um, we bought some cleaner for it, just tested it, doesn't work. And I think we're gonna go get some lemon juice. That was the most recommended from our Myrtle Beach video. And um, also, you know, we know bleach will work, but we're not gonna put bleach in the water. It's just not good stewards. When I've done some digital cleanup, I've been organizing files, getting them off the hard, or getting them off the SD cards and onto our hard drives, just organizing everything that way. So it's been a good, just, <laughs> we just need like an admin day. That's what we need. And so that's kind of what we've been doing today so far. It's been working, working out well. Make sure you guys are subscribed because our next video, we have a really fun one for you. We just calculated how far, how many days we've been on the loop and how many cruises we've had. And we've just passed 100 days on the loop. And we've, this today, literally today was our 50th cruise. So we're gonna do a, a video detailing like how we're feeling, how the loop has been, and uh, some statistics from our journey, including how much it's costed us for the first three months. And of course, you know, you can find that all on our website. We have all of our expenses there, but stay tuned for that. It's gonna be exciting. Okay, so LA just cleaned the entire outside of the boat. So we're looking really nice. We're as nice as we can look in about an hour of time. And Jennifer uh, cleaned the outside of herself. Yeah, I took a shower. <laughs> um, so now our family's here, so we're gonna go Oh, outside. Grandma Carol's here, Ollie. Oh, oh, are you gonna get God. a treat? Yeah, you're gonna get so many treats. Now, you guys may know this, but Jennifer's parents, Carol and Luke, they watched Ollie for us while we were traveling abroad in 2019 for the entire year. So, I mean, they're like practically all Ollie's foster parents. Um, so, so basically Ollie really loves them. I mean, Ollie loves all the grandparents, but Ollie- Loves is, all people. Ollie loves all people. And Ollie is just gonna be going, Ollie's gonna go nuts. It's gonna be amazing. What are we gonna see? What are we gonna see? We're gonna see Grandma Carol. Let's go. Let's go. And puffin. Who is that? 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 Oh my god. There's someone here. Hello! We made it to our 10th stay. Or no, 9th stay. No, 10. Is it? No, it's nine. You counted nine, right? I counted ten. Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, North Carolina, Virginia, Maryland, Delaware, New Jersey, New York. Nine. Wait. Yeah, that's what you counted earlier. Nine. Because we're not twice to ten. Ten would have been bigger. Oh, but we did say ten, I think, right? I said ten earlier. Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, North Carolina, Virginia. Virginia. Maryland, Maryland, Delaware, Delaware, New Jersey, New York. Okay, North nine. North I miscounted.